it's day one of a new plot. Let me show you what I've got to tackle. So like I said, this is the new plot that I've inherited. Front gate. Quick scan. Be careful as I go down here. Open up the gate, there's my bag, shears and fork. I know it's not going to be enough to tackle this lot to begin with, but I'll have a go. I mean the plan is just clear the site just to see what I've got. So look at the shed. Shed number one, I've got three. There we go. Let's have a look in there. It's probably going to go really dark once I enter, but from here you can see I've inherited some slug killer pellets, a nice enough bench, a couple of pots, uh, the previous owners left some gloves, thank you, and there seems to be a spoon on the counter, and what looks to be some washing line, but as you can see it's your standard shed. Okay, coming around through the grassy jungle. There you go. I've got this kind of lean to. As you can see, it's uh, very well decorated at the moment. Hopefully, these won't be here during uh, the next growing season. I'll have chopped these away, chopped them back, dug them all up. A green recycling bin, a water butt or two, there's my neighbour's plot, very nice compared to mine, here's the jungle I've inherited, coming down, feel like an explorer. There's my neighbour's plot on the other side, looks amazing. And then you look at mine. It looks like apocalypse now. There you go, looks like I've got a bit of a wood chip path going up there. Coming down. Some canes. No doubt I'll be uh, putting those to good use in the coming season. Coming down, looking back up to the top of a plot and the woods in the background. To shed number two. Lovely bit of trellis work there on the front. That'll probably have to be replaced. Stuff on top of the roof as well. Come over to here, give you the full frontal of shed number two. Oh yes, I can see me having cups of tea in here next summer. Obviously not with it being in that state. Let's have a look. Door. One open. Okay, I'll have to see to that. Uh -huh. Finally, shed number three. It's a kind of looks like a bit of a summer house. Park glazed good for my tomatoes. Getting all the seedlings started off in there. Have this gate here. Let's have a look in shed three. Ah. That's pretty cool. Here we go. Ah. Previous owners kindly left me a box of Cadbury's roses so I'll be dipping into those later on. Looking out the window. To the top of the shed. And the woods beyond. Looking over to the 
neighbour's plot. Looks great. And then the jungle. So there you go. Your first introduction, my first introduction to my new plot. Very exciting prospect ahead. Pretty daunting as well. Let's just close this shed. And then back up. To the slow wander up. Definitely going to have to get a strimmer. Here we go. Another pass. Coming up to shed number one. I have a bit of a... What is that? It looks like a rose, a rambling rose maybe. Overgrown anyhow, so I'll cut that back. front gate. Yeah. So that's what I've got to deal with. Knock it into shape in the next couple of months. I'll be posting regular updates so you'll be able to see my progress. And hopefully you'll join me in the coming year just to see what I grow, how I grow it. I make most of it up as I go along. Um, so yeah. That's it. So let's tackle this jungle. I'll come back to you in an hour or two, show you the progress so far, and uh, yeah, we'll see how we go. Right, it's two hours later, the jersey had to come off, come and have a look what I've done. So here we go, through the front gate. I cut back some stingers here as you can see. Let's just get through here. There's the front shed, the first shed. Stingers, all been cut back. Jersey hanging on the fork as mentioned earlier, had to come off. That's the pile of cuttings ready for the bonfire in a couple of weeks. Like you can see, I've just cut back the stingers. And there you go, the first rough cut. Bring it down here. There's the exposed wood chip path. Coming down to the canes. Down to this exposed section here with a new path. Here's some fruit trees. Coming right down to the bottom here, it's as far as I got. Looking back up to the top of the plot and the shed, the woods beyond. And that'll do for the first day. I'll sign off now and I'll see you all later.